You are watching the Big Dog Post Game Show, brought to you by Viner Four Gates and the Big Dog himself, Rick Jacklich at the Jacklich Law Group. This is part two of the Big Dog Post Game Show. This time, after Notre Dame tops Virginia in overtime, thirteen to twelve. I'm still Wayne Viner. This is still Bruce Poster. First two great games. What you make of this Virginia Notre Dame tilt? Portal versus portal, and it took De uh, Devlin to come in to get the winning goal. And listen, you got to really give credit to Coach Corrigan. He called three timeouts, down by two, and tied it over time. Overtime, and what did they do, Wayne? They, they scored all out of those three set times. You know, it's hard to believe Peter LaSalle didn't win a faceoff, but I said it to you, with about three minutes left, UV had the ball with a two-goal lead, and they shot within five seconds, and it cost them the game. They could have held that ball down to about a minute and a half, and it would have put a lot of pressure on Notre Dame. But, listen, I predicted Notre Dame to win it all, and I'll stay with it to repeat two on my day. And uh, it's their year, in my opinion. Go ahead, Wayne. A lot of happy Notre Dame people here. Uh, there was a possession before the one Bruce just mentioned where Connor had the ball deep in the left corner and they managed to kick it away. And that cost them 20 or 30 seconds as well. It was there to win for Virginia. They couldn't get it done. I'm actually surprised with the age and experience of that lineup that they lost a two goal lead. But hey, it, it happened. Absolute phenomenal Notre Dame offense when they needed it. Carries the day, and now we have a, 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 probably another classic matchup with two of the best or three of the best scorers of the country on Monday. Listen, that, that controversy at game number one is going to linger over this weekend. Plus, Duke has the rest. Danowski's the coolest cat on two feet, there's no doubt about it. And, uh, you know, the whole big team, led by the guy you love, Brendan O'Neill, who might have just clinched the tour time with UVA being knocked out. But it's him or Pat Cavanaugh, all right? And the winner Monday, in my opinion, is going to get the tour time for what that's worth. All it's right. all about the natty. And that's our two minutes here from Lincoln Financial Field as they re-mow the grass, which is it's very nice, but it's very short as we stand on this resodded field. We'll go in and catch the post-game press conference.